Okay, so I wanted to um, show this three-year-old rod and reel that I got on Amazon. And I've caught a ton of fish on it. And it is done though. It, it served its purpose well. And it is uh, the HA3000. And it it is ready for an upgrade, I would say. Let me see how there you go. So over the years, it's just kind of gotten beaten up a bit, damaged. Uh, kind of lost some of the lost some of the rings here. Uh, as you can see, it's the rod is kind of busted loose there somehow. The bail now kind of sticks. See the bail's not coming all the way down. I have to push it down each time. And I've tried lubricating it. Um, yeah, and just a little worse for wear. I mean, it's got a lot of, a lot of wear and tear on it from, from a lot of, of hard use. Uh, a little bit of rusting out of some of the um, some of the points there, the screws. I've lost my bottom cap uh, to it. It used to be something screwed on here to keep it clean in there from all the sand and dirt. So anyway, I just wanted to kind of show you what it looks like after three years of hard use and uh, let you know I'm super happy with it and I will be ordering another one. Uh, I like the size of this because this fits right into my uh, tackle box. I do think I'm going to uh, gonna stick with this brand and I'm going to try another another one of these poles. I, like I said, I love the size of it. I love being able to just throw it in my in my bag. Sometimes I even, like I just did a video I now put this on the back of my bicycle. Uh, I installed a easy adapter on the bottom of it, and so I can snap this on the back of my bike, and uh, I'm in business. There you go. See ya. That is a solid, that is a solid bass.